How's it going, everybody? Decisive TV here. We're back for another video on our Let's Play world. Today, I uh, I kind of wanted to, you know, do a couple things around uh, our base here or where our starter base is going to be and not the shit check. Uh, so I kind of wanted to clear out a bit of these trees, you know, get uh, a little bit more of the area that we can see. Um, I also wanted to lay out a path leading from our starter base down to our farms. And that will give us um, kind of a, a foundation for how we want to traverse in the world. Uh, I think for this world, I don't want to have to traverse by Elytra a whole lot um, because Elytra is just, you know, so overpowered. And like, in my opinion, it's so overused. So uh, I kind of wanted to go back to the roots of... Uh, Minecraft and go back to like horses and minecarts and that sort of stuff. So, but first, first things first, we got to make some diamond armor and we got to enchant uh, a couple pieces. So, I'm gonna go ahead and sleep real quick because it's starting to become nighttime. Um, hopefully, we get a few good enchants. Obviously, <laughs> I only have iron pants, I only have the pants. So, um, yeah, we just we got to get some better armor because I, I don't want to die as easily. And I think it's about time for an upgrade. We're 14, 14 episodes in now, which is crazy to, uh, to be completely honest. It, like this, These 14 episodes have gone by so quick. And the schedule that I have is um, I record the day before it goes up. So I... Uh, it just it goes by extremely fast because I'm focused on how the video is performing uh, that day or the day it comes up. So it goes by really, really quick. And I'm just focused on YouTube so much right now. So, uh, yeah, but let's go ahead and we'll enchant our first piece of armor. Fire protection four. I'm breaking three on the pants. Protection four on the boots and blast protection on the helmet. I think I'll... I really want to go blast protection. That really sucks. That really what? Oh my god, man! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Only one enchant on each of them. Uh, this game just hates me, dude. There is no way. That has to be like the uh, most unlucky enchants I have ever had on tools and armor. Um, like I re-enchanted the tools a bit which we got better enchants on those the second time around, but the the armor, those first enchants suck. Uh, only protection for and only blast protection for. There was no one breaking on them at all. And our sword just broke. And I got to gather all this bamboo for whatever reason. I didn't plan this today. I'm just, oh, I'm so angry right now, <laughs> I guess. Uh, let's go ahead. We'll make... Some bamboo blocks, 35. That's pretty freaking good. Um, yeah, sadly, sadly it takes a sword to break bamboo. You can't break it with a, um, an axe quickly like you can a sword, which kind of stinks. Wish they would change that, but it kind of makes sense because, you know, all the movies and stuff, and, like, I guess in real life as well, but uh, they... Oh, wait, why am I in here? I don't have a shovel uh nope nothing in there uh all the movies and i i guess for a life you uh you could cut down bamboo a lot easier with the sword than an axe so kind of makes sense but okay so uh i'm gonna go ahead and grab our shovel axe that eh, probably the sword right uh oh yeah we also got a fortune two pick now um i already have a fortune three with mending but this one also has some breaking on it so if we did want to combine them I guess we could. Uh, I kind of don't want to do that though, because we can we can probably just go over to the village and get a mending villager pretty easily. And I should really, really do that before 1.20.3 comes out. Maybe 1.20.1. I don't know if I'll upgrade to 1.20.3. I probably will, uh, but I know they're doing all those villager changes and stuff. So we'll see what happens but so bamboo blocks okay they don't break quickly with a sword interesting three more 
Making progress. Oh, yeah. And I forgot to replant the bamboo before I made the blocks. Don't, don't, uh, don't worry about it, guys. Don't worry about it. We got more bamboo. Oh, it's, like, kind of oddly satisfying to do that. I wish they, the bamboo didn't sprout so sporadically. Like, I wish it wasn't really staggered like that. I feel like just having a row of bamboo that's, like, all in the same spot. Oh, my God. That'd be insane. Okay. Plant all that bamboo. Boom. We got a lot. Oh, my God. We have so much. Holy cow. I never realized. Okay, well, that's 37 more blocks that we have now. So I'm just going to go ahead and put these in. I'll cut uh, whenever I, I get these blocks put in because, you know, it's not the not the most exciting part to watch people put bamboo blocks down, even though it's, it is it is a very satisfying sound. I will give you guys that. Maybe I'll just cut into a time lapse. I don't know. But uh, next thing up, we got to cut down some trees because it will also give us wood for the starter base. So we will uh, we'll see. Oh, yeah, one thing that I completely forgot about because I kind of just run by this and I don't even really think about it is our bamboo farm. Okay, well, we, you know what? I guess it's something. <laughs> I'll just put it in the storage over by our shit shack, also known as your mom's house. Wait, does that make me your guys' mom? Wait a, wait a fucking minute. Hold on. Okay, so using our efficiency four, I'm breaking three axe. Let's go ahead. Um, I think I'm just going to hop into, well, actually, you know what? I might take you guys through with me for most of this because I, I, I kind of want to talk to you guys. I know we had kind of a, uh, a grindy, talkative episode last episode whenever we went down into the mines, but I, I kind of enjoyed that. <laughs> I, I, uh, it kind of gave me like a podcast sort of feel and um, you know, it, it's just nice to talk to you guys and getting comments about your guys' views and opinions about certain topics that we talked about last episode was really, really interesting. So, and it made me think about different things like for, for, uh, updates and stuff, like, uh, what we were talking about, how Mojang has to go through Microsoft and they have like all these multi-level management things they have to go through. But with that multi-level management, they, uh, you know, the updates are slower through Minecraft because they have, they have to go through more, more steps and everything in order to make sure that the updates are what Microsoft wants and not necessarily what the actual developers of the game want. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously they have to correspond with each other, like what they're adding and, uh, you know, th that sort of stuff. But that's between the developers of, you know, the game they're making. <laughs> So that makes more sense. Um, but just, you know, as we were saying last episode, having directors and that sort of stuff for th this kind of game is very corporate like. And I feel like the developer should have more freedom on what should be added into the game. Um, and, you know, who knows? Maybe they have like a whole bunch of freedom. But a lot of people were saying uh, they want inventory management, which is a very, very big big thing currently in the minecraft space that like having Im Im better inventory management would be absolutely amazing and um if you guys haven't seen exuma void uh and his vanilla tweaks team have actually made a mod where uh it kind of it kind of helps with inventory management a bit so if you have shulker boxes in your inventory uh you can like bring up a wheel or something like that or uh uh, like a s small UI or you would press a hotkey in your hotbar and then it would switch be able to switch out in the inventory spaces so like the the slot that I have selected right now has nothing if I press that hotkey it would bring up the lapis lazuli or the name tag and that would that would you'd be able to select it like that and uh, that would be great um, I feel like Mojang could add that I, I it would definitely wouldn't solve it but another thing that the vanilla tweaks had our team had in that mod was um you'd be able to open up shulker boxes without having to place them down and take out the blocks or whatever you needed in or from the shulker box uh, so 
that that was super huge and i think that should be implemented for sure oh uh so i have a um something i kind of want to tell you guys it's uh well actually it's not that big of a secret i guess but uh one of my um longtime friends content creator friends uh Aisley? ace I, I don't know how to say his new name but we refer to him as jack he has a new podcast uh and, and i know oh no advertising podcast well actually you guys you guys probably like podcasts right i mean you're watching these videos so <laughs> you guys would probably be interested in a podcast it's uh it's called around the block and it's basically a minecraft podcast super clever name amazing logo done by one of our other cornerstone smp members if you guys don't know what cornerstone smp is it's the smp i'm part of with a bunch of other content creators as well and just friends um it, it, uh, the series is on my main channel but but that's besides the point i want you guys at, like once you feel you've watched enough of this video or uh you know you're done with the video preferably you know wink wink um you guys should go to jack's channel he has that podcast on there he has two episodes out so far i i need to watch the second episode but they're about an hour long each and he's uploading them every single saturday uh so make sure you tune in every single week but i want you guys to go over there watch a couple of the episodes there's going to be a pinned comment by the way so you guys can just go down there or go into the description i'll have it in there as well to the first episode uh and i just want you guys to absolutely smash the like button <laughs> uh i want you guys to give him a bunch of likes subscribe to him so you guys can stay tuned with the uh the episodes coming out that sort of stuff um you know that, that that sort of stuff i would just i would love to see the difference between what you guys can do uh, on my channel so far you guys have like you guys are insane so i want you guys to go over there hit the like button uh give them some subs if you're you're you think the podcast is good in my opinion it's really good um and just give them some love for me for me from me to him, give him some love. From you guys to him, give him some of your love and that sort of stuff, right? And I'll be checking. I'll be I'll be counting the, the likes from today. And then I'll see what it is in a couple days. That thing better be 100 likes on the first episode. <laughs> that would be, uh, in, I don't even know the words for it. Insane, amazing, amazing, whatever. Uh, just yeah i i know you guys are are a powerful bunch of viewers you guys are just killing it and i i appreciate it so yeah well that is kind of my tree ramble i don't know if i want to get rid of this tree it's kind of it's kind of you know a little bit pretty it's kind of it's big but it's not too big and but it does kind of interfere with the house a little bit but just kind of that little stick out right there so I think, you know what? I think the tree stays. I think it stays. I think the tree shall stay. <laughs> um, yeah, well, I guess we kind of, we got the wood we need for the house. Let's, uh, let's go ahead, put this in here. So I don't, well, I guess we could use birch in the house. Hmm. I kind of want to do that house in one full episode. And I feel like we're already about halfway through, if not a little bit more. So maybe we don't start the house right to today. Maybe next episode we will. Not sure. We'll have to see. Oh my gosh, sorry hiccups. We'll have to see what happens. But we got to find something else to do. So let's go over to the village. I'm going to cut, hop over to the village. Um, I want to get a mending villager. Oh, wait. Yeah, that reminds me. We have some lecterns, I'm pretty sure, right? Yes. Okay. So I want to get a mending villager. Uh, I God, I hope it doesn't take too long. Um, and I want to put mending on all of my tools. Oh, wait. I should grab the emeralds. Cows, come for your wheat. 
Yes. Yes, I know you like it. Uh, let's put a couple torches around here. I just realized there's like no lighting around their cows. You know what? Since I'm generous, you get one too, sheep. Even though you're not actually a cow. But don't tell him that. He gets offended, I think. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's more cows that need to be bred. Okay, there we go. I think we're good. Any bamboo? Wow, 20. Holy smokes. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's just take the carrots. Don't... Eh. I don't need anything else but the carrots right now. And I don't want to fill up my inventory. Even though, I guess we could trade with the, uh... I still don't have a hoe, so that's just going to stay like that for probably another episode or two. Until I fix it. If I remember. Probably won't. Don't judge. Okay. Last row, and then... We will head to the village. I, yeah, I guess I could trade the villagers. Oh, perfect. Two stacks, exactly. Could trade the villagers for our googe. Sugar cane that I don't need anymore, to be honest, but we're going to keep. All right, well, I am going to go ahead and cut real quick, and I will be back with you guys whenever I get to the village. You know what? I'm driving, or driving. I'm boating past these horses, and I realize... Uh, I haven't seen the horse that we tamed and put the saddle on for a few episodes now. Hopefully it's not gone. I did put iron horse armor on that thing, I think. Actually, no, I don't think I did. Yeah, but it still has a saddle and saddles are kind of rare. So maybe we should go find it at some point. And it was a pretty fast horse, so, you know. Okay, at the village. Let's see if we can find couple villagers that we could trap. You know what? You are locked in, buddy. You are locked in, buddy. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we could still get... I'm not crazy, right? Like, we can still get many... Huh? Well, shit my pants and call me a Betsy. What the... <laughs> that is like... That, I think that's the cheapest... Mending book trade you can get too, right? Oh, okay. Stay in there. Stay in there. Please tell me there is a place I can get books. Bookshelves, preferably. Something. Please. Please. Cows. Okay. We can make this work. So there's sugar cane over there. We can plant a small little farm. Oh, hi, pollinated bee. Corral bee. Okay, a little bit of leather. One one leather, really? What? 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 I just realized, yeah, like I didn't I didn't bring any leather, so that's kind of on me. But really, come on, game. You got you do me a solid, do me a solid, game. Just give me some leather. Okay, no whammies, cows. I only need... Oh, perfect. If I can get more, I'll take it. But I only really need three books, but the more the merrier, right? Five? Okay. I could go for the horses, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I kind of want to keep them. Uh, okay, you know what? Screw it, We're, we'll head back. I got what I needed which was three leather because we can make... Oh, wait. No, five leather. Yeah, we can make five books. Um, I'll take this sugar cane. I was already coming over here for it. Eh, made it. I'll take this sugar cane too. I'll set up a, a little sugar cane farm over there as well uh, just so we don't have to go searching for sugar cane. Um, it'd probably also be pretty efficient to set up a cow farm over there, but... And that's a bit of work. That's a bit more work than what I want to put into it. Okay. So we'll go... Oh. Yes, we'll go back in here. Make some... Mother freaking... Oh. 
Yes. Do that. And then place this down so I can make more stick. Okay. Now we need, technically we need 50 emeralds, but I am not willing to trade all of my wood for that. So I'll just, I'll get to 30 because we really only need three right now. Okay, and he's locked out for the day anyway, so. Oop. Okay, make some paper while I'm in here too. We gotta sleep like instantly. Like right as soon as we find the bed, we gotta sleep so none of the villagers die. Get out of there, baby. Oh, baby bitch. Now, where did I lock in that other... Uh, oh, right here. Hi. What the hell? Hold on. What? 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 All? Oh? What is it? What, what the? What? How did you... Oh my god, I'm so upset, man. What the fuck? Oh, you bastard. Wow. Why did he reset? Why are you... Why? 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 What? Well, that the silk touch book is pretty good, but I need I need that mending, ten emerald in a book trade again, sir. Oh, I guess I'll cut back and I'll be back with you guys whenever I get this fool, as a mending villager again. Stupid, stupid freaking villager. Okay, so I am back and call me a cheater, whatever you want. Um, I got a cycle trade mod because. Breaking this thing a million times to try and get a trade that I got the first try. Not very fun, to be honest. And I'm on another time crunch because I always record these videos pretty late. So, yeah. Oh, come on, please, please. Oh, there we go. Yes. 10 emerald trade for a... Freaking mending villager that I got first try. That only took me like 15 minutes total, but that was a, a terrible 15 minutes. Holy cow. No, you are, you will not be able to leave ever, ever. Okay. Well, uh, for some reason, everybody decided now is the time for a communal, communal meeting of the villagers. Oh my God, there's so many of you. There's 10, 11 of you here. 12. What the hell? Okay. Well, time to head back. We got our mending books. We we did what we needed to. And I... Uh, <laughs> I'm just ready to go back and actually do some stuff. Uh, yeah, this way. I think that way leads a different way. I hope. Hopefully I'm going the right way and we can get back to base. Okay, now that we are back, we can go ahead and put the uh, the mending on our tools. Meow. Yes. Sweet. Uh, okay, so now that we got that accomplished, all we got to do is I'm going to go ahead and AFK at the zombie farm, get some more levels. I'm going to enchant the, uh, the armor probably off camera uh, just because it, it takes a long while, to be honest, to, to get up to level 30 and then continue on getting three levels every single time. The, the zombie farm definitely is not very, like, quick. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that off camera. But I'll come back. I'll show you guys what enchants I got and that sort of stuff, if anything has changed. Um... But yeah, I think that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new here. Remember to go check out Jack's podcast uh, and give it all the love. And yeah, I appreciate you all so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day. Bye-bye.